yes our friends uh, greetings wherever you're watching from uh, uh this is jonah and uh here we are again to perform uh another task in construction uh this is this channel it's a hundred percent about construction now today we are going to talk about uh, products or molds out of clay what do we get out of clay and uh many of you have been asking me about mategula half bricks have been asking me about qualitels but here is the time and the time has reached let me talk about this specifically only about this their prices uh, uh their measurements uh how are they sold on the market uh, are they uh, they are sold in what number in what amount so probably this is the lineup we're going to talk about the roofing tiles and mategula we're going to talk about the roofing ridges emigongoja mategula we're going to talk about the quality tiles we're going to talk about the suspended flow units that those are the max pans uh, which are used in the slabs of the flats we're going to talk about the half bricks we're going to talk about uh, the decorative grills we're going to talk about uh, the burnt bricks themselves we're going to talk about uh, a lot so let's dive into this and this is Buildcom Tips Uganda. This is Buildcom Tips 256. Welcome on board. Yes, now I'm going to give you uh, this information. Uh, uh, based on uh, Uganda clays, Uganda clays uh, products. Uh, remember, we we can get these products from different areas, uh, but uh, most of us, most of us, or many of us, uh, get uh, most of these products from Uganda clays. And uh, the prices, uh, the sizes, and each and everything that I'm going to give you, uh, I best them on Uganda clays. However, you can even get them from Reza clays. They are different. Uh, they are different qualities around uh, around uh, the country where you can get all these products. But uh, basically, I best my information on Uganda clays. And um, let me also make it clear: I'm not a supplier of any of these products. I'm ain't a supplier of any of these of these products, but I can give out labor skill on them because I know how to deal with them. I know how to to build them. You know, half bricks, building half bricks, as you're going to be seeing uh, within the pictures or within uh, the videos that uh, that are moving around. Uh, this channel so uh, I can give out labor skills on them uh, but I am not a supplier of any don't reach out to my inbox uh, requesting me to supply you any of these products because most I've gotten most of you that whenever I talk about a certain item or a product on this channel you reach out to my inbox requesting me to supply you things no me majorly in this field of construction I give out just a skill labor skill labor skill so the mere fact that I ha I know I have a skill about uh, all these things, I even get an opportunity of knowing their prices and how are they sold on the market. So basically, that is it. Now let's dive into this. Let's talk about uh, roofing tails first. Roofing tails. These are the mategula, mategula in my local language. Now roofing tails. We have different types of uh, tails, uh, roofing tails, uh, around the country. Uh, first, let's talk about uh, the Portuguese tales, Portugal, Portugal, you know, Portuguese tales, and uh, this tale, this type of tale, you can get it around like uh, three thousand seven hundred and uh, three thousand eight hundred. That's around there. That's the amount where you. That's uh, in between there, you know. Th that's the amount where you can uh, get that type of tale. The Portuguese tail. Now we have the Roman tails. Roman tails. This is between two thousand and two thousand four hundred. That is per tail. Uh, we have uh, the Mongoli. The Mongoli tails. You all know this. The Mongoli tails. Now this is between uh, three thousand and three thousand two hundred. Best around there. Now. Um, Mongoli tales are different from Portuguese and are different from Roman tales. Yes, 
as you're seeing the pictures themselves they are totally different so uh and even the difference comes with the uh with the material itself how are uh, how they are being burnt uh in the clean and um probably there now let's talk about the roofing ridges roofing ridges uh these are the uh migongo you know the ridges uh when we are roofing the matagula stuff so uh, the ridges you can get uh three th you can get it at three thousand five hundred and three thousand eight hundred that is per ridge that is the roofing ridges now let's talk about um the quality tails now these quality tails they are sold in square meters they are sold in square meters so these quality tails are sold in square meters and they are sold in measurements so when you go to the um, uh, to the hardware or when you go to um, these areas to the quality place you must request either 10 by 10 inches 8 by 8 inches 6 by 12 inches you know now these different inches they are also sold in different in different amounts and in different sizes so 10 by 10 inches that is uh, uh that is uh, it, uh, it it we, we can get 16 pieces per square meter of 10 by 10 inches and uh 8 by 8 inches we can get 25 pieces out of this and uh, 6 by 12 inches we can get 23 pieces out of this that is per square meter that is uh these inches now all these they are sold at at, at 38,000 that is a square meter a square meter it is at 38,000 so we can also get uh, 6 by 6 inches now 6 by 6 inches uh, we can get uh, 45 pieces that is uh, within a square meter and uh, this is sold uh, independently at 40,000 shillings now these are the quality tails now quality someone who uses quality tails uh is different from someone who uses these uh, other tails which are made out of sand these goodwill tails the the, the trifold tail the, those spanish tails the egyptian tails you know they are different now uh, uh uh i'm going to talk i'm going to tell you uh the melts and even the advantages of uh, using uh, these clay products than uh, even other products now let's talk about the suspended flow units Suspended flow units, these are the max pans, uh, probably which are used uh, in uh, flats when we are constructing flats to make slabs. Uh, the, the, those slabs, uh, probably when we, we, we are reaching out to another flow of the flat. Now, these max pans, they are sold uh, 8 pieces, that is per square meter. That means 8 pieces make up a square meter of max pans. And... Uh, uh, they are sold around like uh, uh, around between 3500 and 8000 that is per square that is per sorry per um, that is per max pan yes probably around there now uh, let's talk about the decorative grills uh, these are the Pompeys majorly uh for those of you who have uh, those uh those kitchen which are outside which are known to within uh, the same uh, the same house that we, those of you who, who cook food or who cook items outside uh the house where you stay those uh, outside biyungu we always uh, put uh, these uh, decorative grills or what we call pompeys so that uh, they pass out smoke when you are cooking within the kitchen so i know most of you have been uh, in the villages you've seen these you know these type of pompeys around the, the places now each pompey it's around uh, 1400 and uh, 1800 so that is uh, the price uh, of this now let's talk about the half bricks half bricks we have the uh, we have the grooved half bricks and we have the smooth half bricks uh there's no much difference uh, no there's no much difference in the prices but the difference is just in the groove there are those half bricks that have the grooves on them and there are those uh half bricks that uh, are smooth they have that have smooth surface so um a square meter a square meter um is uh 
is uh, a square meter it, it, it is constituted of uh, 60 pieces of this and uh, these half bricks each half bricks each half brick is sold at 600 between 650 and and 807 <coughs> excuse me <coughs> excuse me or oh, 700 so probably around there so if you go to the market make sure you meet this so these are the prices of these um these are the prices of these materials on the market and um because i don't need this uh, video to be too long um, i'm going to upload another video specifically talking about the half bricks uh, the advantages and even uh, the disadvantages of using uh, these uh, clay bricks uh, these are uh, clay products probably on the market so for right now let's consume this and check up for another video probably talking about uh, the advantages and the uh, melts and the and the, uh, and, uh, the, the melts over uh, these products of uh, clay clay products on the market or being used in construction this is jonah and let's meet up into the next video